Hi, this is Chidambaram. Today we are going to discuss about try to pay cycle in e business suite. Here I have considered Amazon corporations. These organizations have a lot of inventories like inventory 1, inventory 2, inventory 3. The inventory 1 may have cloth items, inventory 2 have electronics items, inventory 3 may have food items. So if any of in, in any of the inventory, if any item have shortage, then the people try to purchase that items. So initial stage, the warehouse people will raise the requisition to purchasing department. Once the purchase department receives the requisition, they will create that request for quotations. They will create the request for quotation, then they will send it to these suppliers who will supply those items to the Amazon corporations. Once the suppliers receive that item details, they will store their systems and they will give item details and quantity details and discount details then send it to the send the quotation to purchasing department. Once the purchase department receive the quotations, they will enter those, those details into their systems and they will do the supplier analysis. The supplier analysis is based on this pricing, pricing details, terms and criteria and, and the time time frame to deliver the products. If if they will do the analysis, they then if anything is met their expectations, they will approve that supplier and then they will create the purchase order for that supplier. Then again the supplier, any of the suppliers received that purchase order, they will send the item to the inventory team. Once the inventory team received that item, they will create that receipts. Once the people use create the receipts, they will send the receipt to finance department. In the parallel way, the supplier who send the item to inventory team, the same suppliers will send the invoice to the finance department. Here in the finance department, what they will do, they will they will match that invoices and the receipt. Once the receipt and the invoice is matching, they will start the payment process for the supplier. They will send the payment through check. The check if they created check check, they will send the check to supplier directly through courier or something. If the people trying to send the uh, payment through EFT or wire payment, they will send the information to supplier bank account. After that, they will do the after that they will do uh, GL transfer from here. So this is the overall action items in this procure to pay. Here the all inventory steps comes under inventory module under the RFQ, quotation, purchase order, those comes under purchasing module and the payables, payment, those comes under AP and IBY module. Thereafter, we are going to see how the item is create, how the inventory item is created, how the people are re sending the requisition to purchase de department and all other activities and what are the base tables is hitted in each and every action. So just I am opening that recent corporations.